Have you ever wondered about why AI came out now and not any sooner? You might assume it's because the technology didn't exist before then, but what if I told you it did, and that Google had actually been sitting on that technology for years? Here is an excerpt from an interview that I just did with Mustafa Suleiman. He's the founder of DeepMind, which was an AI research lab that Google acquired in 2014. So he worked at Google for several years until this happened. Lambda was genuinely ChatGPT before ChatGPT. Everyone at Google had seen it and tried it. Probably half the people were just brutal skeptics and were like, this is never going to be safe. It's always going to have hallucinations. And then the other half of the people, including me, were just like, this is the future of search. It's so obvious. We were desperate to try and ship it. We couldn't ship it. And then basically I left and we raised a billion and a half dollars. We built an AI called Pi. And unfortunately we shipped in January and ChatGPT had launched in November. Do you live. think if the timing had worked out differently instead of all saying ChatGPT today we might be talking about Pi? I think so, 100%. I mean, these things are really about timing, yeah. much more than people realize. Yeah. And it kind of makes sense because really soon after we saw ChatGPT come out, companies like Meta all of a sudden had Llama in like two seconds. Technological innovation still exists within a world controlled by the economy, markets, money. The world that we live in is not just build and ship, it's build consider the market advantages or disadvantages, deliberate and compete. What other questions about AI in the real world do you have? Drop it down below and I'll make a video to respond. For more non-pretentious, non-patronizing explainers about AI in the real world, follow this page.